We have a question from Tim. Tim says, I don't own a squat rack, and in my quest for an alternative to back squats, recently happened upon the barbell hack squat. He says, similar to deadlift, uh, but the bar is held behind one's back. I've been doing them for a few weeks and absolutely love them. I don't know if I have the right body proportions or something, but after a few sets, I feel like a mighty warrior. I am curious, though, as to why barbell hack squats are so rarely practiced or even discussed. Uh, they kind of come and go um, in the 60s with sissy squats from Vince Garanda and Larry Scott. They made a comeback uh, in the early kettlebell world. Um, I can't remember if it was Steve Maxwell, Steve Cotter kind of brought them roaring back for a few years. Uh, the issue is, Tim, a lot of us aren't born to do it, and it just makes our knees freak out. Uh, you know, I had a friend uh, go to uh, Tom Platts, the great bodybuilder, went to Tom Platts's uh, workshop. And Tom just said that was, you know, the, that and back squats, the answer to all questions. But once he started watching Tom do hack squats on the machine, he realized that Tom is just built different and um, doesn't carve his knees up like it carves up some of ours. Yeah, I know it's become a new thing again to discount this whole idea about uh, where your knee should be in relationship to your feet. And again, I mean, we all we always go too far in this field anyway, but... Um, yeah, if if a, if an exercise and you're doing it correctly hurts your knees, then don't do them. Um, and in your case, Tim, uh, you you like them, and I got to tell you, you're kind of in rare air. Most of the people I know, uh, I mean, uh, hack squats just uh, just rip the knees. I think that's why. Um, it is a outstanding uh, deadlift variation uh, if you ever just want to play around with it. But you'll find most people like myself, I can't grab the bar from the floor behind my behind my body. I can't. Well, I can't. I mean, I can, but I have to make a lot of adaptions that I don't necessarily like. And and then it rubs against my Achilles tendon and that hurts. And I don't like that. So uh, I'm not the toughest guy in the world. Um, gosh, Tim, I hope that helps. Um, Hack and Schmidt explained to us that the hack is not named after him. Uh, it It's a... German word for something else, um, but uh, because he was known as Hack, we all blame poor Mr. Hackham Schmidt for coming up with it. I don't know if I helped you at all, but you know, hey, if it feels good and you have no issues, do it. I, I know a lot of people do like the Jefferson lift and really enjoy it, and the person next to him says, boy, that just twists me up, or whatever. Thanks, Tim. Good question.